Hello, and welcome back to another nail video. Today, I'm doing long coffin poly gel nails using Rosalind Clear Poly Gel. And I start by applying a thin layer of the Beatles base coat to each nail. And this step is very important because it helps the poly gel to better adhere to the nails. And then I'm going to cure these nails for 60 seconds. And going right in, I squeeze the clear poly gel down the length of the nail. I wanna make sure I have enough product to completely cover the tip. Then I use my brush to pat the poly gel in place. And as always, I'm using alcohol as my slip solution. And I pat the sides of the nail and use the tip of my brush to push that product back towards the cuticle area. And once the product is pretty much in place, I gently glide my brush over the gel to smooth it out as much as possible. And using the tip of my brush, I remove any excess gel before curing those nails for 60 seconds. Moving on to the ring finger, I repeat the same steps as before in let me just say, this Ross and Clear Poly Gel has yet to disappoint. Not only is it really clear, but it's so easy to work with. And if you're interested, I'll leave a link in the description box down below so you can try it for yourself. And my next Poly Gel set, I'm definitely going to do some encapsulation because this clear Poly Gel is just so nice.
I don't know about you, but to me, this is the most satisfying part of the video. Just watching the product glide down the nail. I love a good application moment. I guess it doesn't matter whether it's poly gel or acrylic. So go ahead and comment down below your favorite part of the video. And these are how the nails look after the poly gel application. I wiped the nails off with alcohol before I began fouling. And I'm using this 80 slash 80 grit nail foul, which I purchased from Amazon to foul and shape these nails. And I also used my e-foul off camera to seal the cuticles and buff the nails. And this is how the nails look once they've been foul shaped and buffed and for today's design i'm using this pink nude gel polish from mamita which i purchased from amazon yes i'm amazon girl and i will be polishing my pinky and index finger because i will be doing a french tip on these nails later in the video
I'm using this black gel polish from lavender to polish my ring finger as well as my middle finger and I do about two coats on each nail curing for 60 seconds in between layers. Next, using white gel polish and my ombre nail art brush, I drag the polish down the center of the nail. Now, I'm not trying to follow any pattern and it doesn't have to be perfect because I will be adding color on top of this white. I'm actually going for like a color splat effect. So you will see me add the colors on the next clip. And since this is February, which is Black History Month, my design for this set is inspired by Black History Month, and it turned out so cute. I wish I could have made these press-ons so I could wear them later in the future.
I'm using my black gel liner brush from Beatles to create the outline of my French tip. And I'm doing black Frenchies on my pinky and ring finger like I mentioned before. But after I complete my outline, I then go back in and polish the rest of the nail and cure for 60 seconds. And I apply two layers of this black gel polish. And I use a very thin nail art brush and white gel polish to create an abstract design. Next, I use my white gel liner brush, also from Beatles, to create these thick, bold letters. And I'm spelling out black. 
and I want the letters to cover the entire length of the nails so after I paint my B I go down to the bottom of the nail to paint the K so I can make sure that the letters fit the length of the nail and are proportionate to one another. And these are how the nails turned out. I absolutely love them. They look so nice. Um, I'm gonna try to squeeze one more Black History Month nail theme design in before the end of the month because I did have so much fun creating this set. And again, they look so good. As always, I wanna thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next nail video.